So to begin, it's very important that where you are seated, without too much effort, you can see every person's face. Perhaps you can just move back a little bit there, or move in a little bit. Do we have a seat? Can you see now past me? Okay, adjust accordingly, all right. I have spent a little bit of time here at La Trobe University. They have a fantastic um, uh, language course. And I did it as a, like a part-time thing when I was interested in actually doing outdoor education at this uh, particular facility. And the language thing took us right back to really basic, I don't know, we want to say prehistoric or cave person times where there was not language developed in the way we understand but it was actually just a series of grunts. And I'm gonna share the basis of this because sitting around a campfire at night, they had conversations. And some of them would be very funny, wouldn't they? Yes. <laughs> to begin, it has a form of martial art feel about it. So just to set the tone and only applying it in the air, I would like you to imagine that either of your two hands is like a knife. Just start chopping into the air and making appropriate sounding grunts as you do it. Are you ready? Go. <laughs> 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 All right, good. This is all they had available to them. In fact, they had just three tools. So the conversations wouldn't last for very long, but they would always, always, always start with one person, because they were always very polite, one person would talk at a time, and one person would start the conversation always with, ah! they would always start the conversation with an R. You would note that as I said R, I brought my hand very rapidly towards my throat, but pull just short of my throat because I do find it hurts if I put go all the way through. So ah is the first step of the conversation. Practice that now with both hands. Go ahead. Ah, 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 good job. Having started the conversation, built into it was the ability to continue it. Notice that when I went ah, I'm actually pointing to one person left or right of me. So I could go, ah, point to my right, or ah, point to my left. So just note that. So for example, ah is an invitation to the person on my left to continue the, uh, the conversation with the next piece, which is so. It sits directly above your head, and you say it with a guttural sound like so. So go ahead and just practice so now. Ready? So, and again with the other hand, so. And note also, you could be pointing to the person left or right of you, either way, to the left or to the right. Remember, it's always about where the fingers are pointing, nothing else to do with the rest of your body. So just, just practice that. So, ah, and so, in that sequence, go, ah, so, and ah, so, good, all right. We have just one more piece, because I said, they didn't have much available to them, the conversations didn't go very far, so at the very end, the final piece was that they got to the R, ah. the next person to whom I pointed, in this case, it would be Nairi, would then go, so, again, could have pointed back to me, or perhaps to the person on the left. That person throws the conversation to the other side of the fire circle and goes, co, the word co. So to go ahead and just practice that highly refined skill. Are you ready? Co. 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 All right. Now it's very important that you are very intentional about exactly who you want the conversation to resume with. So this works so much better. Co. So it's really clear that I'm pointing over here rather than co. Because that's, that's a little bit yeah, all over the shop. So you want to be very intentional about that. It's clear who you are pointing towards. So just put all those three together several times to get used to the sequence of the conversation. <coughs> ah, so, co, ah, so, co. All right, you are now ready for the conversation. So we still have just a few four things to learn. But one person speaks at a time, but the conversation has a flow and it's always identified by where the point occurs. So, ah, suggests the person to my left, then picks up with so, and you do a so. So. Beautiful, now points to the person to their left, and you now do co, and point to anyone else in the circle. Co. Great, ah. and now you start from ah. So. Keep going. Co. Ah. So. Co. Ah. So. Co. Ah, so. Go. Ah, so. Go. <laughs> <laughs> All right, hold it there because at some point there's an error. 
the actual conversation comes to a grinding halt because something was out of sequence or something was a bit too slow. When that occurs, they didn't actually tolerate that error very, very well. And so what they would ordinarily do is look at the person. Let's presume it's one of these people over here. I've forgotten your name. Mella. Mel. Mella. So if, let's say if it was Mella, we look at Mella. We then clench our fists. Go ahead and do that now. Throw your finger up in the air and you look at them with a guttural sound and say, you were out of the game. So on three, ready? One. Two, three. You're out of the game. Now, in fact, for now, you won't be out of the game, Ella. But when that actually occurs, and I don't actually enjoy a great deal of elimination activities, although they do form a big part of my program, but for this purpose, you actually have a really special role. Let's say, Mella, you do actually happen to be eliminated. You now come out of the circle. The circle gets a little bit smaller. Notice each elimination, the circle gets smaller and smaller and smaller. You now have a special role. When you're on the outside, let's assume that I'm that person. When I'm out here, I get to be one of those people. Who are those people we call at the back of the comedy club? They're trying to put the comedian off their game. Hecklers. Your task on the outside of the circle is to put everyone else off their game. Remembering, because of course, if they make a mistake, they're out of the game as well and come to join you here. But you have a few boundaries. One, I can't touch anyone. I cannot obscure anyone's view. But otherwise, pretty much anything else is open. I've seen some pretty bizarre things to grab attention to put people off their game in this exercise. All right, so to repeat, to continue the conversation, it always starts with ah, so, co, and the person to whom is pointed resumes with ah, so, co, always look where the fingers are pointing. When someone is either too slow or makes a mistake, they're invited to become a heckler, a very vital role. Circle rejoins, and then within three seconds, the person to the left of the one who came out must resume with R. If they don't, guess what? They're out of the game. So it keeps the game moving. Got the basic idea? Mm -hmm. We're going to do this as a mulligan round, which means we'll go through the, the, the system, but no one will actually be eliminated. All right, I can see you're all feeling a little bit tense at this point, so just shake it out. Shake it out. All right. And who would like to start the conversation? Ah! Oh. Can I do R as well? Nope. No. Oh, yeah. We're up to R. The next one would we'll be so. Okay. Oh. Cool. Ah. So. <laughs> cool. Ah. Ooh. Oh. Ah. Oh. 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 Fingers together. You ready? Yeah. 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 But you're not actually going anywhere. <laughs> but you got the idea. All right, it's time to play for sheep stations, folks. We've got the basic <laughs> idea of what's happening. So if you happen to be a little too slow, and it tends to gather pace as we go on, or you happen to do something out of, out of what should be the sequence, guess what? It's your turn to have some fun as a heckler on the outside. So, everyone ready? <laughs> all right. Because no. <laughs> if you were honest with me, you'd all say no. <laughs> Who would like to start? Ah, so. So, go, ah, so, go, ah, you're out of the game. So come on out, Steph. The circle rejoins, and you're our first heckler, Steph. Well done. Make the circle just a little bit smaller, and to the left within three seconds. Ah, go, so, no. Ah, ah. 